Hello, it is Mac here, and today I'm in the Creator. I'm going to be showing you guys something that's very cool and something that Rockstar has added to the Lowrider DLC. Now, right now I'm in the Deathmatch Change in Pants, which is probably one of my favorite deathmatches ever made, uh, close quarters deathmatch, but I'm going to be showing you guys something. So, a few months ago I made a video talking about I want how I want DLC weapons in the Creator. Now, in this update, they have added... DLC weapons into the creator. Yes, that is right. DLC weapons in the creator. I'm not going to say I was the actual person that, you know, you know, made Rockstar make that change, but I do like to think that, you know, I may have had some part in it making that video, which you want to check out, then uh, you can. I'll have a link down in the description. But okay, so you see pistols right now. You have pistol, combat pistol, AP pistol. Oh, SNS pistol. That's a DLC weapon. Heavy pistol, vintage pistol, and you got even the marksman pistol. You got the pistol 50 cal. You got the flare gun. Now, I don't think this changes on last gen, sadly, because the DLC hasn't come out on last gen. So I doubt it would be. But yeah, you even have like some something like the flare gun, the pistol 50 cal. Now, not every single DLC weapon's in here. The ones like, say, the musket, you don't see them there. But you see the heavy shotgun and the bullpup shotgun, but you don't see the musket here. Same with the Gusenberg Sweeper, you won't see those, but if we look right here, you can see Combat PDW, Machine Pistol, which is the new Machine Pistol, um, and then you can see the Assault SMG, so even some like the Collector's Edition weapons, and uh, I think this is a Social Club weapon, or at least in single player it is. And then you have rifles, so you're like, you know what, I'm kind of getting bored of the Advanced Rifle, Carbine Rifle, you know, Advanced, or Assault Rifle. Let's mix it up. Let's put a deathmatch with a bullpup rifle or a special carbine, even though the special carbine is the exact same as the carbine rifle. Still, if you want like different aesthetics uh, for your deathmatch, that's actually pretty cool. And you have the bullpup rifle, which is pretty cool. And then you have, in the snipers, you have the marksman rifle. So let's say you wanted, you know, maybe a close range sniper. Maybe you didn't want to play like the heavy sniper or the sniper. Just put a heavy sniper, like maybe like right here. I may put a heavy sniper right here. Uh, place that down and place it up here. You know what? I'm not. I don't think anybody would use it, but hey, you know that may actually work in a death match, or maybe like an LTS marksman rifle may actually work pretty well. Uh, okay, so you got heavy weapons now. You don't have the firework launcher, but you do have the homing launcher, uh, which is pretty cool. And yeah, that's about it. You have grenades, I guess. Prox mines. I think that's it for grenades. But yeah, you have the prox. Proximity mine, those could be used in some pretty good captures or something. And you also even have melee weapons, so you got the hammer, you got the hatchet, you got the machete, you got the knuckle dusters, daggers, you got the broken bottle, and that's about it for the DLC weapons right there. Not any specials, but yeah, that, that's just something very small for this. I think it's actually a nice change. I'm probably going to go through most of my jobs and, you know, play some DLC weapons. And uh, mix them in with, you know, uh, vanilla weapons. So yeah, let me know your thoughts on this in the comments. Are you excited? And if you are making any death matches, let me know. Uh, send me them on Twitter or something. Because I want to see a lot of, you know, DLC weapon death matches. Cause I think, or not just death matches, but like captures, LTS, and stuff like that. With DLC weapons. Because I think they are actually going to be pretty interesting. And I really do like how Rockstar has made this change. But just something very small. But it adds just a lot more replay value because, you know, you know, jobs are going to use different weapon sets now. It's not going to be the exact same, you know, assault rifle only, advanced rifle, carbine rifle, stuff like that. It's going to be a little bit different. You can have different weapons, which is very nice. But let me know your thoughts on this in the comments. Hope you enjoy. Feedback is appreciated. I'll see you guys in the next video.